Oh! Ladies and freaking gentlemen, boys and girls, we're out here at Outback. We're gonna get riding today. Yo, buddy, you were a little late this morning. No, you was late. No, you was late. I was, late. I was early. What time do we agree on? 9.30 in the morning. I thought it was 1. 9.30 in the morning, that's Pacific what we said, right? 9.30 in the morning. I got here at 10.45, knowing you, you, knowing you. <laughs> Boy showed up at 1.10, so I've been fast. waiting. I've been sitting in the truck. I've been itching to ride. We even got Colt Jean, buddy. What's up? You made it all the way down yes. from Florida, yes. son. Yes. Hell yeah. We're, we're coming back in two so, weeks, So So uh, what'd you bring to ride? We got the 8.50. Got the uh, whole daddy's money right here. Yeah. I wasn't ready in time, so I had to bring this one. Hey, you always gotta have a spare, right? Yeah, you know. We got the whole crew with us. It's time to freaking rip. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to ride, so uh, we're gonna hop on the four wheelers. I'm gonna put you guys in the truck and let's get it. Oh, man. Yo, get your scrubby ass on the four wheeler. Let's ride. Oh, man. Go ahead and throw her in sport mode since it doesn't start in sport mode. Oh, it's a hot one today, but I'm wearing all of Gator Waiter's waterproof clothing. Uh, if you guys wanna get a discount code and help a brother out, BP10, baby. You guys can use that code. Help me out, help them out, and uh, get 10% off. Colt, are you ready? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We got Colt Jean all the way up here from Florida. Got Joe finally, finally to Outback. That took forever to do. Could that thing be any louder? What? I love my stock exhaust. I'm going to keep it that way for a little while. Boys, on the 32 Naders, I still, yeah, I'm still completely stuck on the Outlander. Hopefully, I don't get too hot. It is, uh, I did not wear the right gear for today. This is probably the worst hole on this trail. Come on, Colt G. Oh, man, he's on the 32 Nader. I'm pretty sure he's on Naders. Oh, man, that thing's bad. I guess I'm just going to have to launch it in there. That hole's, uh, pretty rowdy. Hey, Colt, splash warning. Here we go. Woohoo! On the stocks, baby. Oh, I just crawled right through it, man. You never underestimate the cryptids. Big Joe, I could swim faster than that. Come on. That one wasn't near as bad as I thought it was going to be. Oh, he's falling in this deeper rut. <laughs> come on. He ain't going to make it out of this rut. Should we, like, finish the trail and come back? <laughs> oh, shit. Don't get a. Come on, tire iron. <laughs> Inside jug, baby. So I actually got quite a bit of a story for you guys today about the renegade and you guys might have we might have a video on it soon but uh the renegade i took it to pe to be sold 2021 40 hours i mean thing was meant never sunk never nothing god bought it wrote a check took it riding blew it up somehow canceled the check yeah so now i got a blown up renegade that i don't know exactly what to do with i gotta ride up there and see what i'm gonna do about it and figure it out burr 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 heli to i go huh what's that say b burr bu b burr b burr burr B heli I what's that say? I got to go. Okay, got it. Oh shit. Oh shit. That sketched this the fuck out of me, son. Hey, what the hell does that sticker say? B burr bop be bop boo bop. There you go. B burr bop be bop boo bop. Send it. Like y'all really like y'all really want to see me send it. They said I gotta send it. Mine high or low or what? Oh, that got pretty deep. Well, that was close. Come on, baby. There it is. Shoo! You gotta go back and watch everybody else. The Florida guys are down in the hole. Oh, shit. It's getting pretty damn close, son. Come on, Colt. Oh, yeah? Sending it. All right, Joe. Come on now. Come on, Joe. Hope that bumper don't fall off. I do miss the power the Renegades put out. Don't flip that one too. <laughs> Woo Man, that got deep. This next hole's really long and fun. Let's see if Joe rolls it this time. Here he comes. Into the deep hole. Come on, Joe, don't disappoint. Willie out this hole. There it is. On to the next. Oh, yeah, this next hole's a hell of a lot of fun. Send it. Damn, that sucker's fast. Oh, my gosh. There we go. Woohoo! Oh, I didn't make it over this big lip. Hey, can you wipe my camera? Uh, throw that diff lock on. There it is. Are you serious? I guess when you're running stock tires, you get bottomed out pretty easy. Look at the crowd of people watching us. Hell yeah. There it is. There's that diff lock. Oh, look at Colt. <laughs> I am starting to wish I had a little more power out of this thing. Coming off the Renegade. Oh, 
shit. Watch out for these walls, man. Was he under it? His leg was stuck under it? Damn, son. Jumped in there like a fish out of water trying to get that four-wheeler off him. That could have been bad. Ain't that the second time that's happened? Yeah, baby. Oh, this is actually the uh, the hole that sunk my last Outlander. Hit these walls wrong, you're screwed. Man, I'm not even in sport mode. What the hell? Come on now. It has no, no oomph without sport mode. Why are you backing out? Alright, so Joe didn't make it through that, so now I gotta make it through. Alright, Joe, move your dick. There we go. Let's see if we can crawl out of this. Joe is struggling big time. It's all about that low wheel speed, baby. Look at that. Barely spun a tire. What's Joe doing? He could have just crawled right through that. You're gonna have to hit this again, buddy. <laughs> oh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a freaking torment Joe today. You're gonna be wait four hours in the truck? Are you fucking kidding me? Alright, Honda boys. <laughs> Go! Move it! <laughs> I'll push you. Oh, shit! That's one thing about Hondas. People don't really care if you push on their bumpers. What the hell? Well, maybe, maybe not. Maybe it's the Honda guys, too. <laughs> there we go. You got it. Go! Alright, Joe. Mud Mafia! <laughs> That's for making me wait three hours in the truck! Oh, my knee! Y'all remember when I messed my knee up with the damn dirt bike? Yeah, I'm still to this day having issues. Come on, Joe! See, I can't push on Joe's bumpers, so I can't go forward any. So I'd rather not be submerged while he's stuck. I think it's time you need to learn how to ride. There it is! Just like that, you just gotta crawl. Let those tires work. Oh shit, oh shit. I can't remember if this one's bad. Definitely no one's been in it yet today. So you just gotta let those tires work, Joe. Oh shit. Now if I remember right, this one's bad. That's a wall from hell. Yeah, I remember I couldn't get out of this one last time. See if we can get it this time. I'll give you a grin if you make it through this. Joe didn't even want to try. Yeah, ain't no getting getting over that wall. It's like when everyone's like on the trail and like no one can get around, you just kind of just make your own path. Oh man, I'm sorry. <laughs> so you just go around everybody and you make your own trails just like that. What it is, Joe? <laughs> Joe, buddy, you're going to have to learn to go up these walls. The clock's ticking. I'm going to have to let Joe out. Let me show y'all how it's done. Nah, I'm not fighting this boiler. Steeper than I thought. Wow, I can't believe we were just now getting down with that first mud trail. We were in there for a minute. Yeah, baby. Oh, look at the Honda. That's deep. Wow, that's deep. That is really, really deep. Oh, shit. There we go. More mud. Be up. Man, those damn foilers are loud. Couldn't hear myself think. Oh, this is a fun one. You got it. I want to go to you. You got it. I'm not going to flash your phone. Oh, I'll go first. Don't splash me, though. Huh. It felt like it wasn't in sport mode, but it is. Splashing myself. Yeah. This wall is terrible. Go ahead, throw that diff lock on. Beep. I'm gonna get this some bitch. All right, I'm gonna hit this some bitch hard. I might roll it, but all spare in the love of war, right? Here we go. Damn it. Well, that was easy. Came up right there. I was not expecting to come up right there. The left side's not as hard as I thought it was. Boys act like they know how to ride a wheelie. Ah, oh, shit! <laughs> oh, it ripped the waiter! No! Bro, look at that shit. Fuck. It grabbed the freaking gas cap. Oh, my rear brakes are gone. What? No! I cracked my brake light reservoir cap. Look right there. There's a little little crack right there. How did it crack right there? That's probably why I came back on that wheelie. The, the brakes weren't grabbing at all. What? Oh, sorry. Oh, that boot's exploded. Maybe that's why I feel like I ain't got no power. Why does this always happen to me? 
Hey, watch out. Cut this sucker with a knife. Maybe that's what's robbing power. I'll go till it explodes. And see, I broke that piece. What the hell? Outlander's falling apart with six hours on it. Man, and now I got sand all in my jacket and it won't zip up. Well, whatever. Yeah, both tires are spinning. Man, ripped my waders open. Got something caught in my axle. Blew an axle boot. Now my jacket won't zip up. That's some shit right there if I've ever seen it. My brake reservoir was leaking. My brakes went away. I might just have to go the hell home. Dude, my brakes, look, they're gone. I keep losing them. I really actually have to start ramming into trees to stop. Oh, shit, my waders. Ah, it's not my day. This thing doesn't want a wheelie worth that shit. Bro, what the fuck? What's going on? I might as well just riding my boxers at this point. My brakes, bro. My brakes are gone. No, this is stupid. If I can't do wheelies, I don't want to ride. Mike's got nine hours on it. Ah, how do you like it? for like are you serious pretty sure i just dunked my snorkel stick probably got water in the air box probably foil is gonna explode next most normal people would check that real quick but uh screw it things gotta go get a shop anyway why not go ahead and build this motor well my thing you can do is make the best of it baby go hit the snorkel what the hell where's all the water well this is kind of uh trash supposed to be a snorkel pond There's ruts in here, bad. I might just go ride dirt bikes tomorrow and stay dry. See if it'll climb up and out right here. You cocksucker. I mean, boys, we all have these days where it's like just nothing can seem like it can go right. The day's only cost me a $200 axle, $200 pair of waders. Gotta figure out how much it's gonna be to fix my brakes. I wasted about four hours in the parking lot. Just gotta love it. Gotta embrace it, baby. They hate us because they ain't us. It's kind of like with the Renegade, so I guess I can talk about that now since I'm just kind of creeping around this pond. That Renegade, man, I sold it. Dude, thing was meant. I might go just put a new motor in it and start riding it again because that thing's really pissed me off. Friggin' sold it to a guy pretty good price he wanted to put a new radiator in it and this that and the fourth had old performance e so you know we did went ahead and paid for all that and uh he bought it like saturday and took it to busco and somehow canceled the check before it actually went through and got cashed which is some which is some shit, man. That was way deeper than I thought it was gonna be. Barred the foiler, basically, blew it up, brung it back, and I ain't got nothing to show for it. I was at least, I was gonna offer to pay for half the motor rebuild just because I felt bad, but you know, then it canceled the check, and now I just got a fucking blown up four-wheeler. Show these idiots how to ride. You! Come on, Joe, I'm coming for you. I'm coming. Hey, buddy, I'm gonna need you to move. It's getting kind of deep. Ah, oh, the water hit my balls, bro. Why am I even in waders? Oh, bro, I think the first mud hole. Yeah, bro. The first mud hole I ever took the Outlander in. I think it was that one or that one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, now it's sticking out the outer of the wheel. That's nice. At this point, I might as well cut these into like some booty short waders or something. I got you, buddy. I'm kind of on top of your rack right now. <laughs> Uh-oh. Bro, why? how are they stuck together? Oh, it's gone. Nope. Oh, it's hooked to my four-wheeler. Uh, yeah, no, you're good. Everything's perfectly fine back here. Or right, pull that front end up. Damn it. Now I'm going to have to bomb a new freaking tail light. Sorry, Jay Brown. Well, dude, you you hit that water so hard it blew your tail light out. I know what's wrong with it. It ain't got no gas in it. Oh, there it is. Well, now it doesn't turn over at all. Well, boys, we're towing the Honda back. We really haven't done a whole lot. But uh, a lot's definitely has broken and gone wrong. This year it can't have pulling a Honda. Dude, my waders freaking busting a hole in them. That's such a freaking letdown, man. How? the hell are they gonna catch on the gas cap of all things so the ratchet strap led to the brakes going out which me trying to fix the ratchet strap led to sticking my jacket since the brakes went out that led to my waders getting hung up in a wheelie and ripping and then that led to me having wet feet somehow it led to one of my snorkels going under i just i can't even remember i was dealing with a lot bro we made a half loop around the park and that was it i definitely wish the outlander had a little bit more power when you get into this sand and stuff you could use it. Gonna go home, take a shower. Outback's definitely one great park though. I love this place. Oh, let's get this thing on the truck. Hopefully I don't fall going up this damn thing. I mean, everything else today's went pretty wrong. Hopefully my brakes hold. This thing doesn't come flying out the back of my truck. Hope everybody enjoyed today's video. If you would, please hit the thumbs up button, like, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, we got more four-wheeler videos to come, but uh, today is just like everything that went wrong, could have went wrong, went wrong. One of those days. If you guys would, 
please hit the thumbs up button, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch y'all on the next one.